The fall equinox is just around the corner with the new season officially beginning this upcoming Sunday morning, September 22nd. Many associate the fall with the harvest of all kinds of crops like pumpkins, apples and squash. And before electricity, farmers relied on the brilliance of the full moon to aid in their harvesting during the evening hours. And thus, the full moon closest to the equinox is called the harvest moon. The harvest moon will officially be full on Tuesday night at 1034 p.m. and will appear more than 90% full two days before and two days after. This is the second of four super moons in a row, appearing on average 7% bigger and 15% brighter than a typical full moon. Only one quarter of all full moons are super moons. The moon will also pass through both the Earth's outer shadow and a part of its inner shadow on Tuesday evening into early Wednesday morning, causing a partial lunar eclipse. The eclipse's peak will occur at 1044 p.m. on Tuesday with 8% of the moon in the Earth's inner shadow, appearing like a bite has been taken out of the top of the moon's disk. With the development of potential tropical cyclone 8 off the coast of the Carolinas, expected by the National Hurricane Center to become Tropical Storm Helene, a large swath of the eastern United States will unfortunately have cloud cover obscuring the skies on Tuesday evening. So it would be best to enjoy the nearly full harvest moon on Monday. The full moon will also likely amplify storm surge from PTC 8 along the Carolina coastline. Jeremy Lewan, Newswatch 16.